right, we're here looking at some of the vegetable research that we have at the Research and Education Center in Georgetown, looking at weed management in particular. One of the things that we do is look at different strategies for controlling weeds and vegetables. Um, part of this is taking some of the information that we've got from corn and soybeans and seeing how well that might transfer to, to vegetables. You know, one of the practices that uh, corn and soybean growers are using is no-till and cover crops. And we're looking at, in this particular study with sweet potatoes, looking at growing sweet potatoes in a rye cover crop and how effective that might be for sweet potato production as well as for pest management. Some of the other trials we have out here, uh, we're looking at products, herbicides that are not currently registered, looking to see if they have enough crop safety and effectiveness for use in vegetables and see whether there's potential for getting them labeled. And if there is, working with the EPA and U.S. Department of Agriculture to get labeling for these products in vegetables to help out farmers in managing their weeds. In total, we have about 10 to 11 different vegetable crops that we're researching here at the, at the farm. Everything from lima beans and um, um, sweet potatoes, sweet corn, to uh, some of the cucurbit crops like watermelons and cantaloupes grown on black plastic. We have a wide range of pro projects ongoing with vegetables here in 2017 at the Research and Education Center.